All right, so this is the Nexstar SE4 with the Next Image 5 and iCap software. Now I have 0.5 times focal reducer attached. And this is the image that I'm getting from across the street. Now we're going to next image five. This is the whoa. <laughs> this is the focal reducer I got. It's uh, astronomical. I forget the name of it. I'll put the link in the description. So now we're going to go without the focal reducer here. Not too bad. Now what we'll do is go back to the focal reducer. So, with the focal reducer, I have the entire limit sign in view, but I'm noticing some vignetting or whatever. I think vignetting is dark, but what I'm getting is some brightness in the edges, and I, I suspect that's the cheap focal reducer that I bought for 30 bucks. Uh, I might try a different focal reducer this one seems to work well with the eyepieces but it doesn't seem to work well with my Canon and the T adapter so I tried it with the next image 5 this morning and I'm getting some some distortion in it on the edges and now that could be my exposure setting we can try lowering the exposure and eh, I had the exposure right Maybe we can try lowering the gain. No. Yeah. So we got the whole entire limit from speed limit in there with the focal reducer attached. And without the focal reducer. See, there's significant difference. Wobbly telescope. I only got the LIM. Thanks for watching.